we're gonna need hand out chapstick too. Lots happening all day long. Oh yeah, if you want to go full Joseph Kennedy the third, get your Carmex going and get it into the corners of your mouth. You want to get a good. Uh, that's what I like to do. That's who I gave like the response to the like right state here. of the union. Yeah, I know, no, we get it right here. But I showed up out there last year without chapstick, and they saved my life. You know how it is when you're kind of addicted to chapstick. Are you addicted to chapstick? Oh, I'm, I, if, I'm not if I walk out of the house without I have a pocket, used chapstick. I don't know. Well, you have like lip gloss and things. True. Yeah. Yeah. I'm a guy. Okay. Need my chapstick. <laughs> All right, eight thirty. Let's get to news. A man suspecting the disappearance and murder of a Valley Kindergarten teacher was just an awful crime scheduled to be in court this morning, but not for that case. Charlie Malzahn pled not guilty to robbery and third-degree burglary. He's accused of assaulting an ASU student in a dorm room and the carjacking another student in a parking garage. Also, the prime suspect in the murder of Catherine Gorospi. She uh, took pity on him and wanted to help him out, went up to Flagstaff, bailed him out of jail, and police say he then killed her. Not clear. Uh, he, he skipped out on several of his hearings, so we'll see exactly uh, whether or not he shows up today. This morning, we're hearing from a Valley man who was stabbed by his neighbor. He says he never met or spoke to that neighbor before this happened. This happened last Friday, apartment complex, Hayden and Camelback. 58-year-old Thomas Williams says he heard a loud bang, called 911, went outside to see what it was, and that's when he says Keaton Formica confronted him and stabbed him. He ran and hit under a truck. He said he uh, didn't stop stabbing. Or the Patriots, come on down and represent your team. Yeah, we're Eagles we, well, you're obviously Team Eagles with your green outfit today. We're going blue now. Because everyone says blue. I'm with you. Wait, blue. We, have we, we? <laughs> we have the results, do we? We have the results. What are they? Results. What are they? Go ahead, guys. Uh, I'll read them. Hashtag blue dress is coming yeah. out. Green dress, boo, it's 15 percent. Okay, so. just one final question, though, and let me remind you, you are under oath. Did you or did you not say that you were wearing Eagles green this morning? <laughs> when it was brought to my attention, 